Hi everybody. Thank you for being here. Uh, today I'm going to do some light switches. Uh, panels, light, light plates, I mean. So, uh, I've, I've done these before and they come out really cute. I've sold them on eBay. I've sold them on Etsy too. They, I've done them for, for children and for adults, rooms, living rooms, bedrooms. So we're gonna do, I'm gonna do these just to show you. Let's see. Okay, I'm just taking a dry sponge and I'm gonna pounce on a little of this, this green. It's just an acrylic paint. And this is a really easy real easy project to do, to paint. Ah, I'm going to paint that in there so much I don't think. Leave that open. You can paint it any way you want, but that's what I'll do here. Glad y'all could be with me today. Just take your little sponge. You can get it um, at any of the little hobby stores. I think you can get them at the Dollar Tree also. I, I don't know. I'm sure you can. And so you just pounce these you know, you put your paint on here all over, just in the same, same areas. And for, for the little screws also, you can, after you paint them, or before, you can go ahead and pounce, you know, pounce your little, the little screws so they'll match. And when, when we spray it later, when you spray it later, you can, you know, put the screws in and spray them at the same time. Real easy, real easy to make. You can't go wrong with doing this. Hope everybody's ready for a good weekend. We have a beautiful weather here. Getting ready to go to New Orleans soon. We're here in Texas, Southeast Texas. Okay, so I didn't want to come over this much. I want to stay about like I am here. So I'm just going to kind of rub some of that off. Stay kind of in line with it, same as in here. You know, make it kind of the same, like that. Okay, and this paint should be dried first already on the on the first plate. Pretty dry, you know. Okay, um, just let that sit there. So we'll go here and uh, what I'll do, do is I want to draw some, uh, pa not draw, paint. <laughs> I always say draw, I mean paint. I'm going to put some white daisies in here. I think I'm going to put a clean sheet of paper on here that pounces and makes a mess. So let me just put a clean sheet here. <clears throat> so what I'm going to do is put some uh, a couple daisies in here. Let's see. Thank you. 
show somebody paint some in here. Maybe. And you can make the, you know, the, the this here, the three three light or double light switch plate. You can make you several of these to go around the bedroom or wherever you put this. Okay. Put those through there. And while that part dries, we'll go to this and we'll do the same thing. Can you see me? What I'm doing. We'll draw another little daisy here, daisy petals. And these add really a nice accent to rooms. They look nice in kitchens also. Okay. Uh, let's see. What else I'm going to add to it? I'm going to add some... Uh, I'm going to use this little, little kind of round pointed brush. And I'm going to add some little pink and pink and white flowers to it. Uh oh. So, I'm going to let it sit down like that. So right here I'm just going to put a little pink. So I dip it in the pink and the white. Pink and the white, that's all. Just Okay, we'll do the same to this one. So we're bringing some color into it now. Let's see, let's try to put the same pattern over here. And you can do the, the little colors for the little girls, little boys' room, different patterns, you know. Okay, add a couple here. You 
Okay. Here's some pink flowers. Um, I'm going to take my... I'm going to just take this little uh, filbert brush. It doesn't matter any kind of brush you want to use. Just to add in color. So we're going to put some purple in here. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to dab some purple in just different spots just put in just different places here just to just to put color you have to paint anything I'm just gonna add you know add, add the color that complements the pink and the green and purple does that Places, you know. Okay, that's good like that. All right, and let's see. With this little brush here, this is just a little cheap brush. I'm going to take some of this um, uh, brown. I don't know which one it is. Anyway. I don't worry too much about what the, color, the name of the colors are. Just I just use them. <laughs> okay, so for this bigger daisy up here, I'm going to add this to the middle of it. Y'all can see that okay, right? cotton tool <laughs> that I like. Well, before I do that, I'm going to take my liner brush here and, and my darker green here. Oh, goodness. I think I need a little bit of, little bit of water because it gets thick. Maybe a little bit, but anyway, I'm gonna put some little, oh, a little bit more water here. Oh, it's really thick. Draw some of the little stems to the flowers. See, this doesn't take long. 
these make nice little gifts too, you know, just... Okay, now I'm going to take my little daughter. <laughs> I like it. Okay, I'm going to fill in some little... Centers to the flowers. Okay, I want to thank you all again for being here. I appreciate it. appreciate your comments. And um, I enjoy the painting. I hope you do too. And that's it. I'll do some more of these, but I like doing these. They don't take long. They're a lot of fun. They are. They, they make cute little gifts. I've sold a lot of these, like I said, on eBay. I've sold some on Etsy. Um, and uh, thank you for being here. Thank you so much. Y'all please come again, okay? Okay, y'all take care. Thank you again. Bye-bye. Oh, and I wanted to say again, like I did in my other video, you can spray this on your cover plates, your switch plate covers. Spray this on and um, don't go out in the weather. I spray mine in the garage. I leave the garage door open and I use this on them. And uh, I let them dry real good. Sometimes I put a second coat. You don't have to. And they're fine. They'll last forever. You just, you know, clean them with a wet cloth or a little soap on it. And they do fine. They clean really nice. Okay, thank you again. See y'all later. Bye-bye.